winds dropped down a little bit because we're behind that big dune at the minute. So just thought I'd post a bit more video. As you can see, it's high tide. Look how calm that is. Beautiful. The water's just slapping up on the beach there. He's had a few swims. He's missed this place. So that's how far I've walked. To be honest, I wasn't going to walk that far, but I'm uh, I'm quite enjoying myself. It's a lovely night, really, apart from that wind. It might have been so quiet. So I'm just going to continue on. Maybe walk the end of the beach. See what what happens. Let's see. He's loving it. Letting him have a good run out. I'd feel a bit guilty if I took him home already. See how happy he is. So, yep, let's continue on. Right then, so what's this then? Is it periscope off a crashed German U boat? A stench pipe? A secret underground bunker for Blythe County Council? I wonder what it is. If anyone's got any ideas? It's not a stench pipe. There's no holes, no vent in the top. I suppose it's not a vent pipe even for a bunker, so strange. Who knows? There you go. Let's see if any of you can work out what that is. Who knows? Wait, there's something under there though. Right, got all the way along the beach, all the way from right down there, seeing Zeus, to right here, live. You can see we're getting closer to the pier and the live itself now. I must show you these. These are like little cabins you can hire in the summer where you can sit and get changed and have your cup of tea and what have you, whilst the kids play on the beach. And they're very, very popular, as you can well imagine. Lovely little things. I don't know how much they are to rent per day, but they're lovely little things. I don't know if they've got beds in them, if you can sleep overnight. Um, there's been talk about Whitley Bay getting them on them prop notes, but that's been getting discussed for years and years and years, and it's never happened yet, which is a bit of a shame. I'm glad to see they don't look as though they get much vandalism. But, uh, what a fantastic idea. I came through here in the summer and they were very busy. You know, on these things. You can sit there and look out the sea. I think actually on the back as well, it's got the same sort of door on the back, so you can look out the back when uh, the sun's setting. You get, the, you get the sun all day. So, yeah, great idea. Now there's the lifeguard station up ahead. And underneath that's a little cafe. Been there once or twice. Lovely little place, get a cup of tea and a sandwich. What else is closed at the minute? Can I be helped? I'll come round. And that over there is a very popular place. And pardon me for my zooming technique. Lovely little place to get ice creams, fish and chips in the summer. As you can imagine, that's one popular place when the sun's out. So we're just gonna walk back. Across the dunes now. And, uh, as you can probably hear, that wind is still in the light now. Look at the speed that's going. That's going to earn its keep in these winds. I'll tell you what it is, it looks as though it's going to come flying off in a minute, so I'm not going to hang around here much longer. I don't know on that. Uh, Flying at yeah, that speed.
gonna get. Right guys, we're back in the car park. So don't forget, if you like what I'm doing, press the like button and subscribe if you haven't already done so. I really enjoyed that today. I think he did too. So 